Now you've had time to reflect. And you must have some thoughts. Yeah, it shouldn't have happened, yeah. What else do you want me to say? Uh, sorry, it might be a start. Of course I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm sat here for the kickoff. I'm sorry your missus didn't get what was coming to her. How's that? <sighs> See, he's learned nothing. He's incapable of learning. I'm not. I want to know why he thinks he's got the right to take another human life. That's how it is in my world. If you'd have grown up where I did, you'd know. Oh, come on, we've all had rough starts. It doesn't mean we turn into psychopaths. Yeah, most of them don't have quarter of a million in the bank either, do they? This is about more than money. Did you suffer any kind of physical or psychological trauma growing up? Seriously? If he wants to play psychiatrist, he can get himself another guinea pig. I could, but they wouldn't have killed a person I love most in the world. Did you ever kill as a child? What, a person? I was thinking about animals, really, for sport. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I did, yeah, because I was really big in the local fox hunt. I would always be there in my red jacket, my riding boots, blowing my little horn. And there was the, uh, yeah, the grouse shooting in Scotland every year. Did that. A lot of murderers start out with animals. Listen, I might kill the odd spider, but only when he had it coming to him. <laughs> I wasn't tying fireworks to cats, if that's what you're driving at. And in fact, I kicked my mate's head in once because he punched his dog. <sighs> wow, you're all hard. Interesting. So, my mum was the first actual person you killed. If it wasn't, lad, you think I'd tell you? Time to move on, kid. I wanted to talk about your upbringing, your parents. Not to be said. Dad died years ago. Auntie Sharon took in me and my brother. I mean, thanks to her tender guidance, here I am. And where's your brother now? That's me. We have what you might call a love-hate relationship. You like the Gallagher brothers, you know? So better looking. So what happened to your mother? What happened to? I heard you. She died when I was a kid. How old are you? Does it matter? It might. It's fourteen. Ah. What do you mean ah? Are you writing? The loss of a parent is classified as an adverse childhood experience. One report revealed eight in ten prisoners have at least one ace, while nearly half had four or more aces. This kid for real or what? No, don't underestimate him. Did your mother's death send you off the rails? <sighs> Did your mother's death send you off the rails? A bit, but I don't intend to turn into you. That's good. It's good, that kid. There's no offence. I think you struggle on the street. You know, as we're talking about family, how's this feel? Sitting across from your mum's killer. Hey? Eh? Because I'd have given anything until I had five minutes with my mum's cancer. I'd have sorted it apart. How do you feel about me, little man? Okay, Karis, I think that's enough now. No, I'm okay. I'm not the one who's upset. Come on, you must be nearly finished by now. The police didn't ask me this many questions. I'm almost done. But I want you to really look back at what you've done. Not just killing my mum. Everything. When you think about all the hurt you've caused. Do you feel any remorse? It'd make you feel better if I said I did. That's not why I'm asking. Would you make the same decisions again? Well, if I didn't know it'd leave me here, then probably, yeah. I did what I had to do. Do you think your mother would be proud of your choices? She's got nothing to do with her. I think it has. What was she like? Would she have approved of your life? Of course she wouldn't. What sort of a mum wants a jailbird as a son, eh? My mum was decent. She wanted the best for us. You know, and everyone said she had nothing. She'd give them a last fiver if they were in trouble. What good did it do her? What good did it do her? Dead at 42? My mum was 40. She sounds a lot like yours. Loving, kind. I miss her every day. Is that how you feel? I'm done with this. I'm done with this, right? No more questionnaires, no more letters. Right, I'm done with you. No more! Open this gate, man. 